Hey everyone, Dave here at Stevens Reptiles, I'm showing you briefly today how to determine the sex of your western hognose snake. Um, you can do it visually or by scale counting. This is stuff out of their nest box that just came out. Um, so this is the female right here, and she is proven. Uh, so there's no question she's a female. It's kind of hard to hold them both at the same time, but it goes from the length of their, from their vent to the tip of their tail, or you can count their scales. And if it's 30 to 35 scales from the vent to the tip of the tail, it's a female. Anything over 40 scales is a male. So if you look at his tail right here, you can see that it's much longer and skinnier. So you got his vent there. And if you counted those scales right there, it would be 40 plus. See if I can get a picture of them side by side. Nah, that's not easy there, but you can see his tail is longer, even though she is longer than him. <clears throat> you can see how her tail tapers faster than his does right here. It maintains the same width down here and doesn't taper until it gets further down the end. So again, hers, she'll come back out. It just tapers faster at the beginning and is skinnier t more than halfway down. Determining the gender of hatchlings can be a little bit trickier. So this one, if I can get her in front of the camera, looks to be a female. You could count the scales. You can take a snapshot photo of the tail itself and count those scales. It would probably be somewhere between 30 to 35 scales. You can also look at it and just tell that it's a shorter tail than the next one I'm going to pull out and show you. This one, when compared to the previous one, you'll be able to see the tail here and that right where my thumb is. Right where my thumb is, is the vent. And you can see how long and skinny that tail is compared to the other one. And if you were to count those scales, it would be 40 plus. There are some that are in between the longer tail at a male and shorter tail at a female. Sometimes you just have to wait until they get a little bit older and then you're able to um, determine their sex easier at that time. Uh, but that's a quick short of it. There's also a probe method and a popping method. I'll do them on other videos, but Western Hog knows the easiest way to determine their sex is to Look at the tail. Hope this helps and see you on the next video.